in with that deadly string of tornadoes. The Weather Channel's Mike Seidel is in Norman, Oklahoma for us this morning. Mike, good morning to you. Good morning, Meredith. Behind me, some of the piles of debris scattered across Tornado Alley. Yesterday, 37 twisters killing five, totaling 40 houses. Hardest hit Oklahoma City, the most tornado-prone city on the planet. Big the worst of the twisters hit at rush hour. We're in the debris! Tornado after tornado with the worst damage in and around Oklahoma City. The deadly storms leaving a devastating path of destruction in their wake. This tornado just laid down on the ground and absolutely chewed up everything. Power lines mangled, houses shredded. We shut the door, we're in the closet just in the nick of time and everything went. I looked up and the roof was gone. Cars and even heavy machinery tossed like toys. This was a significant storm and a deadly storm. We have a number of businesses that have been totally destroyed. Here in Norman, just south of Oklahoma City, Ray Trumbull, his wife Tammy, and their two young children were watching TV when they saw the tornado and ran to their basement shelter. So it's coming this way. So we just ran, ran in the shelter, and uh, as we were running in the shelter, I saw it across the neighbor's house over there. 30 seconds later, they heard the tornado rumbling overhead. The force of the wind toppled the garage, trapping the family inside the shelter. Once we heard the wind kind of kind of slow down, my husband tried to push the door open and we couldn't push it. In their haste, they'd forgotten to grab a cell phone to call for help. All they could do was wait. The tornado hit their garage, is a very large garage, rolled it over on top of the storm shelter. Right now, they cannot get out. Hey, Neighbors and rescue crews used chainsaws and muscle to remove a mountain of splintered boards and debris piled on top of the shelter door. The boys, ages six and eight, were scared, but the parents were stoic. We knew somebody would find us. And one by one, they were all rescued. Careful. Even Jersey the dog, safe and sound. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. Yes, I'm okay. Everybody's okay. And this morning, we look back at a deadly three weeks, uh, Meredith. We've had 21 fatalities, counting the five yesterday. Going into mid-April, it was the slowest start of the tornado season on record. That has changed dramatically now over the past three weeks. Back to you. Mike Seidel, thank you very much.